Hello everyone, this is Brady with Lewis Motor Company and today we're taking a look at our 2009 Peterbilt 335 utility service crane truck. It has an auto crane 10,000 6H, it's a 10,000 pound hydraulic crane, it's got a hydraulic air compressor, it's got a nice tool body on it. We did a number of things to this truck including repainting, sanding down, doing some metal work to that utility body on the back. Did a lot of mechanical work, did a lot of service work to this truck. It's 100% turnkey and ready to rock and roll. It's got 191,000 miles on a Packar PX6 engine, so six, seven liter turbo diesel that starts right up. Sounds great, you can hear that now. It has an automatic transmission, We've got an aluminum fuel tank on this side here. Just overall a nice truck. Now, when it came in, it did have some rust on the utility body. So there is some body work showing on this truck. Uh, but overall it does show nicely uh, with no major areas of concern and no major rust showing. Well, like I said, we welded in some new panels. We did some box floors. We did some body work on it and it shows really nice. The engine was replaced on this truck in 2017. So the hour showing is a little over 2000 hours. Um, could possibly be the hours on the new engine, uh, but it is not showing the original hours. It can't be the original hours, it's too low, but that may be the hours for that new engine. But we've got good tires all the way around. pressure there but got one large toolbox in the front that's all we've got just that one toolbox up front so you could add your toolboxes if desired but we'll get to that in a second we'll check out the interior here interior shows nice we got a legacy seat here I believe this is yeah, it sure is. Uh, aftermarket obviously upgraded and it shows real nice. It's an air seat. Ooh, that air conditioning's cold. It's a hot day today and she is blowing nice and cold. 191, 395 on the miles. Again, 2494 on the hours, 2494 hours. Again, the motor was replaced. Maybe that's for the new engine. Uh, it's hard to really say. Uh, but we do have some creature comforts here. We've got an exhaust brake, heated mirrors, got a locking differential, cruise control, does have power windows. So it's nicely optioned, AM, FM radio, heat, air conditioning. Again, it is working. There's our Muncie PTO controls. It's just a flip of the switch for your PTO. The floor shows really nice on this truck. Not a whole lot of wear showing. Headliner's in nice condition. It's a Peterbilt, so this thing's in a really nice looking uh, interior. You do have some wear showing on this uh, door handle here. Sounds like Robert just opened her up a little bit and idled it up. So again, one toolbox, opens and closes as it should. Uh, but you can see on some of these box floors, we did replace them, they have been repaired. Uh, you can see some welding marks, but it's all very solid. Again, we did repaint this whole box, so you can see some body work showing. Uh, but it, it is a solid body at this point, and it shows nice. You got good drive tires all the way around, frame underside. You got a little bit of light surface for us, a little bit of scaling, but all the major, major structural type stuff is in good condition. You got a little scaling there on the frame, uh, but no major areas of concern. These boxes show nice, with a little bit of scale to the sides of them there. This bed floor is a little bit wavy. And again, the bed has been repainted. The entire bed was repainted just because of rust and some wear. Rear step bumper has been completely repainted. It's good for a workstation. So cool thing about this truck, it's got a wireless remote. It's got two hydraulic outriggers. So they're fully, they do extend on both sides. You don't typically see that. So that's cool. So street and curb both extends hydraulically and they go down and up hydraulically. You can 
can see our auto crane is functioning as it should. Wireless remote. It is proportional. Everything on this truck works as it should as a mechanics truck. Compressor operates as it should as well. So it's a very turnkey truck. When we bought it, everything worked. It was just that it needed a little bit of repair on the body and just some mechanical type stuff. We did some seals on the engine. I've got a full list of what we did to this truck, but we spent a ton of money on this thing, just getting it right back to uh, ready to rock and roll condition. We do have a hitch receiver off the back. Now looking in between the bed here, this all looks really nice. They did a great job with this. Got our hydraulic outrigger controls there. Uh, but in between the bed, it shows really nice. Got some tie downs in here as well. Uh, but everything here has been repainted and refinished. It shows really nice. Crane functions as it should. You can see Robert is over there just getting her done. Winch cable looks like it's in nice condition. This crane functions as it should. I've got a picture of this crane chart in the actual listing as well. Now looking down this side, again, it has had some body work. There's no surprises there, but it does show nice. We did some metal work, we did it right. We cut out all the nasty stuff and put in new metal and it shows really nice uh, it's mostly on these box floors you can see it's a little crusty in there we do have a hose reel on this one and it's a water separator pressure gauge up there as well all these tires are in nice shape I do believe we did four new rear tires on this so I have to look at the listing but I believe we did four new rear tires again frame underside all had some light Surface rust, a little bit of scaling on the factory undercoating, but it does show pretty nice under there. Looks like this floor was replaced. Again, all the hard parts been done. Did some welding up top for the boom rest as well. But the truck does what it's supposed to do. Everything on this thing seems to work. Uh, it's a nice looking, running, and driving truck. It's an 09, so it doesn't take DEF. Uh, we did a little bit of paint work on the cab itself, but not a ton. I believe we painted the hood on it and some areas, just a little bit of touching up. But the truck is right, shows nice. Got a little bit of peel on the front bumper here some minor dings and dents got aluminum alcoas all the way around it and it's an 09 so you got some minor dings dents scratches scrapes things like that but the truck starts right up runs and drives as it should the crane works compressor works truck goes down the road as it should we did a ton of service work to this thing so it's going to be ready to rock and roll we'll fly in and drive this thing home you can find this truck out for sale on our website which is lewistrucks.com that's l-e-w-i-s trucks with an s.com service trucks like this don't last long if you're watching this video it's probably already gone by now but give me a call and we'll try to get her sold to you uh, we are Lewis Motor Company, We're located in Clarksville, Maryland, which is just outside of Baltimore, Maryland. We can ship this truck throughout the United States. Call me and I'll give you a quote on that. Great service truck, 10,000 pound crane, hydraulic air compressor, under 200,000 miles, pack car, PX6 engine, automatic transmission, aluminum wheels, aluminum fuel tank, auto crane, everything is ready to rock and roll on this thing. Give me a call, we'll get her sold to you. Thank you guys for watching.